President of the PSA, Watson Duke, says he's been told that all monthly paid staff at the Shagaramas Development Authority are to be laid off. But the chairman of the CDA, Gupti Lachmidial, says this is not the case, although the company is currently facing a manpower audit. Peter Christopher has more in this report. The president of the PSA headed to Shagaramas on Sunday to make a statement of concern. Come April, May, we have learned via a whistleblower that this monarchy government is bent on sending home all monthly paid employees of CDA. We are talking about 50 monthly paid employees that consist of upper class management, middle management, technical staff, and the basic administrative staff. 50. But when contacted, the chairman of the CDA, Kapte Luchmidial, said this was not the case. There is a manpower audit at the moment taking place. The manpower audit is going to advise, when you look at it, they're going to advise the, 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 the board how to restructure. We're going to restructure the organization and keep in our core business. Over the last three, four years, the CDA have expanded the staff and increased salaries up to 150% to some people in some cases. The CDA chairman said there has to be some level of restructuring at the CDA as the company currently pays more money in salaries than it makes. He said an audit revealed that salary expenditure increased from 850,000 in 2010 to 2.8 million in 2015, without staffing being increased at the authority. But what they have done is to take people from working for 8,000 and take them to 20,000 a month. And that will put a significant strain on our resources. We cannot handle our recurrent expenditure by paying more than what our income is in salaries. And there lies the problem. The PSA president, however, believes the workers should be spared the axe as the government can save money in other ways. So if the government is interested in saving money, then let them cut out those bad rent they are paying for buildings that are not occupied. But certainly, they can follow the money. If people are, are paid a whooping set of money, follow the money and find out whether or not these people pay themselves or someone pay them and if someone pay them then you pull them before the appropriate tribunal don't let the people suffer because someone pay them that's wrong that's mad and we will not stand up with that the psa president thinks this action could see the cda following the fate of the tourism development company a belief that the cda chairman thinks is unlikely given the mandate of the shagaramas development authority act peter christopher c news